Hey guys, it's Carl here and what an absolutely phenomenal day today is. It is November the 5th and a couple of days ago we had a couple inches of snow all over everything and then now a couple days later it's 15 degrees and sunny and beautiful. A little bit breezy but it's a beautiful day and I just couldn't let it go to waste so got the boat out, came down here to Lake St. Clair looking for some of these late fall largemouth. Here on St. Clair these largemouth really group up in the fall and they start to feed really well and they get fat and healthy and it's just a really good bite. So hopefully we can get into them today. The whole parking lot is empty. There's not a boat on the water other than some duck boats so I am really looking forward to having the whole lake to myself and getting into a good largemouth bite. There we go. Get him back. I need that summer craw, English choice summer craw. Yeah, get that back in there. really tiny but it's a bite you new craw the craws uh, getting low on these so this is an angler's choice flapping craw I really really like these craws Mostly because of the really stout body. That body's super thick, got a lot of meat, holds the hook good, doesn't tear up too bad. Claws are awesome. When they fall, these things just flap around like crazy. Like, really good craw. Do like this color in the fall. The other one I really like is this, with the orange belly. Yeah, really like these. Nope, too far. So that's a Gamagatsu heavy cover flipping hook. And I'm just gonna Texas rig or Texpose. So I bring the point through right there. So the point's all the way through. And then I just pinch it, tuck it back under the plastic. So now it's actually quite weedless. I got a tungsten bullet weight with a stopper. There we go, we're all set. getting a little bit bigger not much but a little bit there you go nice little guy you can see that black spotting in that fish in the tail some kind of disease that doesn't really seem to affect the fish at all but you see, it's quite common here you see it a lot but I'm gonna get him back good fish Getting a little bit better. Look at that. 
feel that fish. I just saw my line jump as soon as it started to fall. That line really jumped. That hook there. He is. First one on that side. A good chunky fish. But they're just not really big. Look at the black in his lips. Got two black dots on his lips. It's kind of neat. Yeah, what a beautiful fish. Look at him back. Again, not a giant, but a good, healthy, fat one. They're just, they're just really good, healthy, big fish. These are nice, but no big ones yet, so they'll come. Here's a good one. Yes, yes, yes. That's a good one. That's the kind of fish I've been waiting for today. What a good one. Right in that thick, heavy stuff, it's really, really thick stuff there, but yeah, that's gotta be, gotta be four pounder, close to four pounds anyways. I'll put him on the scale just to check, but what a good one. I don't think he's much better than four, but he's at least a four anyways. Really love these clips, they're awesome. No puncturing the fish, just takes care of your fish. So let's get him on the scale here. I don't think he'll go much better than four, but, oh yeah, 4.3, so, oh 4.4, yeah, 4.4 pounds, so almost a four and a half pounder. Good fish, we'll get it back, yes. Yes! There are lots of spunk with that guy still. These guys are, uh, they're a little sluggish. This water's getting cold and they are a little sluggish, but they're still eating really good. Yeah, what a great fish. Again, got them on that summer craw, colored angler's choice flapping craw. Just love this color. It does so good in the fall. This place gets a lot of pressure. It's, it's a kind of a community hole and gets a lot of pressure and uh, pretty much everyone's throwing black and blue, black and blue, kind of the normal stuff. So I do like to mix it up a bit. This pumpkin, it's kind of like a pumpkin and chartreuse color. It's just really different. Shows up good in this blue water. And I do catch a lot of fish with that. I really like that color. Well, our sun has gone away and it's actually gotten quite a bit cooler. The wind has picked up and the cloud covers come in. The sun's gone and it's gotten a lot cooler. I had to put my jacket on, but uh, fish are still biting. It's still getting lots of these little fish to bite. So hopefully it will continue on. guy he was wrapped right up nice such good, these are such good quality fish that's awesome such a good one nice. guess it's not hard to mark this spot eh? into 
doing good. Again, no size, but just a lot of fun. These are great. good fish he just kind of picked it up as I was pulling it out he just came up behind it and picked it up I didn't even get a good hook set into him but good solid fish such nice quality fish just good looking clean fat nice large most good fall fish so just gonna get him back Another pretty good one. So I guess I'm gonna end it with this one. Good healthy fish, not a big one, but just thick and healthy and fat. Just a great looking largemouth. Really good looking fish, so I had a lot of fun today. We'll get him back. Well, what a good day I had today. Really enjoyed this afternoon. Bass fishing in November, it was reasonably warm. It started out really great. What a great morning. It was sunny and warm. Once the, the clouds came in, it did get a little bit cooler and windier, but still caught fish the whole time. Not a lot of big ones. I got that one good four pounder, which that makes the day pretty awesome. But lots and lots of bites just to keep me busy and lots of activity. So yeah, really enjoyed that day on the water. So I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you subscribe and I hope I'll see you outside.